Let's take a little tour of 8th Street at the heart of Greenwich Village. Fifty two West Eighth Street. This building right here was where the Hans Hoffman School of Art was originally located. And between nineteen thirty six and nineteen fifty six, when Hans Hoffman finally retired to paint full time, this was the heart and soul of the beginning of the New York School. Jimi Hendrix Electric Ladyland Studio was also in the same building, right here on West 8th Street. This is the New York Studio School here at 8 West 8th Street. Now this initially was the Whitney Studio Club and became the Whitney Museum in 1934 until they moved uptown in 1956. Oh boy, you can still hear the folk singers playing in the coffee houses and the pizza joints. And this is University Place. Thirty nine East Eighth Street. This is a location where there was a second floor loft, and that was where they founded the Artist Club in nineteen forty nine. Group of artists including William de Kooning, Milton Resnick, Philip Pavia, and Ed Reinhardt. This was the beginning of the New York School. And right across the street, the building that was located here, number forty eight. This is where the studio of Jackson Pollock was. Uh, he inherited this studio from his brother Sandy. And that was where he executed the Guggenheim mural that became so famous. And just around the corner from the Artist Club, this location, 24 University Place, was the site of the original Cedars Tavern until 1964 when they moved up the block. 82 University Place where the Cedars Tavern moved. Now they've got a new apartment tower and the old bar is gone. Now we're coming up to Broadway. Oh, now we're coming up on Astor Place. This is Cooper Union. music. And this is where East 8th Street turns into St. Mark's Place and you really get into the East Village. There's the new Cooper Union. Some pretty snazzy architecture. This is where all the hippies came in the late 60s. I think if you saw the movie Hair, a lot of it was filmed on this street. And back in the East Village days in the mid 80s, this was quite a scene. It still is. They cleaned it up a lot. That's a little tour of 8th Street. I'm going to call it quits here at 2nd Avenue.